everybody. Joy from the do-it-yourself world. Well, it's been a while since I made a video. I had a little bit of a rough time there. Um, this weird coughing fit that wouldn't go away day and night, non-stop. No, I don't go to doctors. And it was just up in here. I went nothing down in my lungs. Um, didn't stop me from from working but it stopped me from talking to you and making a video so I don't think you want to hear me go now I don't think you'd understand what I was saying but I think if you look around you see I've been busy I can talk now um, last couple days have been clearing up I've been hauling firewood and I'll I gotta empty the truck and trailer. It's a heavy, heavy load. I'm not pleased with how heavy that was. That was a wetter batch and I don't like how the truck was sagging. I don't like the load at that low on that truck. But that's a face cord. It's only a face cord. Anyway, let me get us all emptied out and I'll, I'll take you around and show you what's been going on. Been busy, just couldn't talk. split this out in the field with Melanie the other day with the log splitter so I can go get it quicker home and re-split it here the proper size but it's got to get out of where we're getting it quick so I'm doing it quick It's heavy, it's wet, oak, good oak, a lot of it, a couple pieces of pine, they burn. This is what I can bring home in two trips with a truck and trailer. Not bad, eh? Uh, there's a load of wood. It's four face cord. I gotta get my breath. Here you might notice something new. I have a carport set up and I gotta fix that top. Funny. I fixed it and then the wind picked up. So I've got, I've got experiments going on. I have here a sort of a solar kiln. I'm experimenting with different types of wood, different types of wood drying. And uh, I've closed this in because it was raining when I did this. And let me take you inside. I have extension cords running to the solar panels and powering two box fans. So I'm not wasting any electricity or money on this. And I had this wonderful idea of a wood stove in here, but I never got a chance to do it because I'm too busy out in the woods hauling firewood. So that's just there. It's a good place to keep it out of the weather though. I needed a place for it. I got that for free. So there it sits. So I've got here um, dead standing oak that I've been cutting and splitting. That's dead standing. And I have a fan. I had it on a chair and I stole the chair to sit on. I've got a fan on here, solar powered, and we're getting some good 
good cracks in here in this wood. Really good deep cracks going on. So you can see when wood starts to crack like that, you see it's drying rapidly, and that's important. I want a rapid dry. And uh, I just put this one on yesterday, actually. Right here, and this one, actually, I just put on yesterday. So you can see it, it is absolutely rapid drying. Now over here is dead down oak, which was uh, dead but on the ground. And I'm experimenting with fans blowing down the middle, big air gap in the middle. And I've got the fans blowing down through there to keep air flowing. And uh, just natural um, outdoor temperature for now. I just, I don't want to waste any money or energy on this, but it's an experiment to see if solar powered fans can help dry the wood faster. And this side is not drying as fast, but it is getting drier. I can see the difference and feel the difference when I pick up a piece of wood. You can see here some that I had for a few days and some that I just put on yesterday. You can see the difference in color. So uh, these here I just added. But I'll keep filling this room up and uh, see what happens. And I'll keep you guys updated on how my solar powered kiln works out. Here's a pile of green which is gonna grow once I get processing that, that load I just hauled in. So there's a pile of green. I'm gonna put that in there and see what happens with that. And I've got a mess of wood here to process and get split and stacked. I'm hauling wood in nonstop. It is a lot of wood. So I've, I've really got some experiments going this year, a lot of fun. Now that I can talk again clearly, I will be uh, keeping you guys updated on how it's all going.